a mentee with the cultural centrist lens, uh, who's also a person of color, um, is likely to underestimate the extent to which a white mentor um, can is willing to help them and able to help them. Uh, the willingness comes from a notion that uh, people are not as willing to help members of other groups as they are members of their own group. And then the other has to do with the notion of um, there are limits to the extent to which the experience of someone who's not in my group can actually be relevant to me, especially when you move into mentoring around the softer issues of being in an organization, how you manage the culture, how you manage the politics, how you present yourself. Um, and uh, that often leads the, leads the cultural centrist mentee then to not seek those relationships across lines of race. Um, and um, where I found people who I think possess in some significant way a cultural centrist lens, but who've also been successful at um, developing relationships with m white mentors, they usually have both mentors of their own racial group as well as white mentors. And the mentors of their own racial group often help them uh, to get the most out of their relationship with their white mentors. Um, so one piece of advice to the cultural centrist is to develop a heterogeneous as opposed to a homogeneous network of uh, relationships or developmental relationships.